Empire's Material Science and Technology Lab always needs strong partners. Imperial College is one of the leading houses we can work with, and particularly when it comes to these concepts of artificial intelligence and drones, we have there an ideal partner to bring these things forward. Imperial College London is known for its excellent collaborations across disciplines and with colleagues all over the world. We're very excited to strengthen our European ties through this partnership with IMPA and the ETH domain. Dr. Mirko Kovac is a world-renowned roboticist. He's recently won the Royal Society Wolfson Fellowship to support his internationally renowned work. And his collaborative research and his vision will help this partnership to thrive. Future cities will be like ecosystems where robots, the built environments, and humans work together in a symbiotic relationship. Now what we just study here today is to look at how drones can be part of that and how they can interact in a safe and sustainable and low-cost manner with building technologies. One drone is a patrolling drone or a diagnostic agent as we call them, which has a tethered system that supplies the power to the drone. Once we identify something that would need further inspection or more close inspection, we can send a perching drone to the site that would detect and sample the surface using contact-based mobility. How it works is that it uses a full SLAM system on board and we test various algorithms and approaches how to do that to fly to the surface, identify the anchor point using machine learning approaches and then attach an anchor point and have a string that is pulled back as it flies away. And it can then use an algorithm that does the navigation in a way to allow the vehicle to perch and suspend itself to a completely vertical position. Afterwards, it can move up and down on the string, similar to a spider, and look at the surface in much more detail. The partnership with EMPA is important because it enables us to use new materials and new insights on the structures, functional and smart structures, that we can then combine with our robots to build a new generation of soft flying vehicles. That's what we can explore here, from research to development to bring it to the market, making innovation happen.